Hello Zebra, welcome back to Mario vs. Donkey Kong. Today, we are tackling the expert levels here in the game. After completing all of the stuff before this, we're ready to take on EX1, which of course has all of these eight expert levels. I don't know how difficult this is gonna end up being, but we're gonna find out together as we tackle this first one. I took a little break from the game after beating the main portion of it, so I really don't know what this is gonna be about, but we'll see. Oh. The music was a little different. I might be rusty. So I can press the switch to move that trash can and these conveyor belts back and forth. I see all three presents over here. So if I were to hit this switch, at the least, and this also isn't a guide mini Mario level. This is just like a normal run of the mill level. Okay, that didn't quite work. Oh no, come on, jump, jump, jump. Ah, oh, I can't quite make it up there. I wonder if there's a wave out. Maybe all I'm supposed to do is this? Because then, where is it? Oh, it's down here, perfect. Okay, that might be good. Because now, I pick this up, I put it here, no, no, no. Maybe just here. Jump, 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 got it, awesome. So now I do that again. I get all three presents, not too bad. So how are we getting over this way? I mean, to me, it seems like all we need to do, press this, jump up here, pick this up, put it back down, get back down this way, and get it to lower. Then I can go under with it to pick up the key, reset the timer. Then I switch this like this. Oh, huh. Can I jump and throw it? Maybe? No, uh, not quite. Okay, so here. Switch that again, maybe? No, 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 switch it like this. I'll bring it with me because uh, I think I need the blue switch pressed. Then I'll leave it down this way for a second so I can press this one. Oh, I might need to bring the trash can over. Is that what I'm missing? I might be missing that part. Yeah, okay, okay. So the key might disappear. I need to go grab that trash can super quick. And then we switch this over in a moment. Yeah, this might be a little bit tricky for a second, but I think the trash can is the key to what we need here. I mean, I guess the key is the key, but the trash can is the key to getting the key over to where we need it. But we're running out of time. I forgot there was a timer. Uh, Put that there. Um, Get this over here, come on, go, go, go. Put it down like this, no, put it down like this, I might run out of time. Oh, this is not good. I forgot there was a timer. Uh, 10 seconds remaining. I don't think this is gonna work. Come on, run Mario, run. There's no way, there's no way. But I'm certainly gonna try. Dive under that, and then, uh, yeah, darn. And I run out of lives, <laughs> as if that matters. Game over. <laughs> I guess I get the restart. Off we go again, Mario. Let's give this a try. So I basically just have to do that, but faster, right? But now that I've figured it out, I just switch this over. It's gonna fall down there in a second. And now it's down there. I think after it lands off the spikes, it sort of bounces off to the side, which is perfect for us. Cause I can just jump up like that. Jump, 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 got it. Very cool. So I wanna pick this up again, switch it over, put that down, go and get this here. Once this key is on that spot, oh, we have so much time now. Uh, I should be able to just toss this over here, switch this button, pick up the key again, just so that I have that going on. Come on, Mario. You need to just switch the conveyor belt one more time. And then I can reset this, chuck it over there. Same thing with this one. Very nice. And then what I wanna do is this, I think. I might be wrong, but if I can hit this switch, right? I can toss that up there. No, no. Keep it like that. Then Mario, jump, 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 jump again. Pick it up, and we should be good to go. I can see why these are called expert levels. That's a tricky one just to start with. All right, well, I'm happy to get it done. Now we're moving on to EX2, right? Well, level EX1, no mini Marios to save. 
but we still get the perfect and three gifts. So happy with that. And let's see what we got next. EX2 right over here. Okay, stage two seems to have these disappearing platforms. I'm sure juggling the key on this might prove to be a bit difficult, but we'll find out. DK's down there, <laughs> he's floating. How are you doing that, DK? Whoa. So what's the goal with this one? I see a present to the right and a present to the left and then one way up there. So it seems like with this one, it's just sort of a mad dash to the top. I really don't know if there's too much in the way of, uh, whoa. Really much puzzle solving with this one. Oh no. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Mamma mia, indeed, Mario. How are we getting through this one? I need to be very careful. Oh no, on how I handle this. Because I could just go like this, got it. And then maybe up here, I can just run, run, run. Oh no, oh, that might've been a mistake though. Because yeah, sure, I can get over here. But then, what do I do from here? Maybe if I'm lucky, there we go. All right. Now we're doing good. I don't know how I survived that. That was a mess. But all I need to do now with our platforming prowess is jump over here, pick that key up, go like this and fall all the way back down with it. One step at a time. And then I go, go, go. We made it, wait, we made it. <laughs> that one didn't take as much, I guess, mind power. <laughs> as the first stage did, but it did take a lot more tricky movements. It was a fun one though, for sure. So it seems like all of our Mario vs. Donkey Kong skills are gonna be tested here, not just one type of Mario vs. Donkey Kong skill. What do we got next over here? Stage three has these lava bubbles. One thing's for sure is that no matter what kind of challenge it is, it's a test of patience. I see one present here. If we keep going to the left, I see the red and yellow ones. Right over there, so I'll wait here for a moment. Oh my, whoa, whoa, I did, okay. That is not what I meant to do. I did not mean to jump to the right like that. I wanted to try this, okay. Oh, okay, that worked perfect. I, I would rather not risk doing that again. So we should try to get up here. Do not get squished by that stuff though. Oh man, oh man, <laughs> that was, Really crazy. I think I'm gonna jump, yeah, like that. And then I guess, who? no, I didn't jump up high enough for that. Oh, that was a little deceiving. Darn. I'll do this and then go under. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> okay, Mario. I'm just trying to get to that. It, it's really difficult. I got really lucky the first time. Go under that. Oh. I'll get it on the way back then. Okay. Jump, you can't make that jump. I keep on thinking you can make that jump. You can't. Uh. Okay, we're doing pretty good, but I'm sorta of just waiting for it all to fall apart. Wait, ooh, what happened to my extra jump? Uh, Mario. There it is, boom. I got everything, but heading back is gonna be the real challenge now. I might wait a little bit, We'll see how this slams down, because I think it might, oh my. Okay, we're fine, because I go like this. <laughs> Getting back with the key. It's the big challenge now. But I get that part right there. This is the scary part. I'm trying to really intently wash, watch what exactly ha happens here. I gotta go under that one. Oh man, wow, that was close. But then I get up here, pick it up again, and go through the door. Phew, that was scary, really scary. But the third stage is done here at the EX course. All right, good job, Mario. Let's keep it moving. What do we got next? We got stage four here. This one is the sort of a uh, Merry Miniland themed. So it seems like we're going through each theme with each level. Yeah, I get that, that's pretty cool. We got the uh, bob -omb over here. I have two presents on that side, one present up there. This present seems pretty simple to maybe get to if I could just, yep, do that. Grab this. Okay, I think my goal now should probably be getting a bob -omb over to the right. 
And I guess the best way to do that would be to jump through this block and then just to put it down. We can get that key over here. Now, just because I have the key doesn't mean I should probably use it just yet. If I wanna to get to the left and get that blue present, what would I have to do? I would have to activate the red one. To do that, I need to get back up there. Or actually, here, let's actually do this for right now. I might be overcomplicating it, because I can just, wait, if I can pick you up. No, I can't, okay, that didn't work. Um. Oh, I see when it's like that, then I switch into the red one. Cool. <laughs> That's still an issue. Gotta keep that in mind. Uh, now I gotta do the whole thing again. So we'll get back over here. I will do that, press the button, switch back down this way. While I have this, let's just toss it up there like that, go through the box one more time, do that, and then that'll bust open the one door area, which is good, but not everything. See, I don't know. Huh. Let me try that again. Getting back up here, switching up like that. If I throw the bob -omb up here. Oh no, I don't even have to. Okay, that's what I was trying to do before. I just sort of messed it up. So that should explode now. And I get this. So I guess now I want to get to the left there. Oh, if I get the blue switch, that should answer all of our questions for that one. So I get back over here. I hit the. <laughs> I hit the blue, <laughs> hold on. Just like this, get way back down there. Grab our third and final present, and then we're just focused on getting the key that we've already gotten previously. To do that, I mean, I guess this time, could I just do this? No, that wouldn't be enough. So, I'll get through here. I will switch to the yellow one. Yeah, maybe. Hold on, oh, I can't get up there like that. I guess I just press this button. And then I jump up, press the button, fall all the way back down here, pick you up. I almost got hit by the bob on there, I would've been so bothered. Just do this, there you go. Please don't move, thank you. Now we can move over. And I guess with this one, if I can just, whoops, uh, Toss it up like that. We're getting somewhere. Oh. I should be able to make it. Whoa, I made it. Awesome, there's that stage done. Definitely a difficult one, but still I think probably one of the easy ones to figure out so far. So we're halfway through this world. Good job, Mario. Let's keep it going. What do we got next? We're halfway through. Let's do the other half here with the thwomps. All right, DK's looking around. Here we go. Uh, and the thwomps are thwomping. We got the thwomps, the thwimps. It seems like we just have all of our presents sort of all in a line. For right now, I need to avoid you. Ooh, okay. Oh. Grab this one, whoa, that was close. Oh man, jump again, thank you, and I'm out of here. At least we got through that. Wait, don't come up with me. Oh no, I see why this is challenging now. Not to see that, say it wasn't like challenging before, but really stepping it up now. Okay, you slam down, don't squish me, and I swish this like this, at least blocks off that guy. Okay, get over here. Ooh, there. Oh man, close. So I wanna be really careful of how this is done. If I'm fast about it, I can maybe, oh, right now. Oh, they all sync up in a really cool way though. Now I get up here and I hit this. Wow. Uh, now this shouldn't be so bad. It looks difficult, right? But as long as I, no, ah, oh. Okay, um, move with the flow. Move with the flow of it. Good, stop, come on, Mario, pick that back up. Okay, 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 stop doing that. <laughs> uh, put it down there. Get back over here. Oh, 
Oh, come on. I'm trying to avoid them. You're kidding me. We were so close. Yikes. Not good. All right, Mario, get back in there. This time we're doing it. We're just gonna zoom through. Got that part. Boom, easy. Yeah, it's unavoidable when it comes to the thwimps. You just, you, they have to come up with you. So no way to sort of leave them in our dust. Not so good in that way. Okay, I got it this time. I got it this time. I can't believe it. Took me a good couple tries to get back up here, but we found our way through and we get to the end of this level. That means we have like what, three more left? I don't think there's a Donkey Kong fight at the end of this. It's unlike the other worlds, that's for sure. But uh, let's see what we do have. We have level six over here. That's themed after the ice world now. It really is one for every world. So for EX6, DK's back at it again. We're way up here, we're slip and sliding everywhere. I do see one, two, three presents. If I go through that red one right now, I can at least get down there and get the blue present. Then I'll have to come back up. After that, I wanna go to that blue switch to my left. That'll enable me to get the red present, hop down and get the yellow. Okay. And then I should probably grab the key in that time too. Yeah, overall, this doesn't seem too bad. Actually, I wonder what might be better. Hmm. Jump down here. There we go. Get that first one without too much of an issue. Jump back. Oh, I can't go down there. Gotcha. So that's the first present done regardless. It's still not bad. Then I jump down this way, hop up here, press that button. Then I go back through again, very slowly. Hop on to this part, boom. Slide under here, grab this little present, or this little key. Oh no, hey, 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 <laughs> not what I wanted. I want this key down there, right? By the end of it, yeah. So if I were to toss it over and catch up with it, I can hit this switch, go through here. Uh. Yep, just like that. I will need to, no, 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 no. Toss it like that, join it right after, boom. Then I can pick up the final present as, whoa. No, 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 ooh. Throw it like that. I gotta follow it, one more time. And we should be finishing this up. That one was surprisingly easy. We do one on the first try, I can't believe it. Awesome. So with that done, we get three more presents. Oh, yeah. Mario is as happy about it as I am. Level EX6 is all finished up. What do we have next? Level EX7, of course, which will be of the Mystic Forest. Yeah, that was our first level we've done here that I didn't fail in some way. We got it all done on the first try. What is going on here? here we go. Is this? Mario versus Donkey Kong or Bomberman? I don't know. I guess we just have to bomb our way through. So I hop onto you, run back over here, and I just wanna place that down just like this. I don't wanna waste any time. Okay, I guess I'll grab that. We need to get more. So I would like to just bomb this one so that it reaches the next bob bomb as soon as possible. So I think, yeah, that was pretty good. I'll have to wait for this one, but we'll wanna strategically move towards the next set of presents. Uh, to be honest with you, I think that, right over there, okay, wait a minute. I'm gonna pick this one up, but don't get too worried because we still have this bob bomb too. So if we're trying to maximize our time, I break that like that, and then, oh, run! Oh, that was close. Which one's gonna make a bob bomb first? This one will. Getting back up now is gonna prove to be a little bit more challenging, but, do that and then run, got it. Okay, so if I can just get over here really fast and get that present, then I can, come on, really? That's questionable. I'm clearly trying to jump on the bob on. The game had a bone to pick with that move, but we will just try again. Come on, you pop out of there and then go for the present first and foremost, just like we did before. So right here, I could have maybe done one to the left. Ah, oh, that's fine, grab that present. Run back over here, and then hop on this straight away. 
put it right here. Once again, I probably could have done one to the left, but it'll clear it out pretty well still. And then I wait for you. And I'm not gonna go too crazy with this one. We just need to put it maybe here. And then, wait, why didn't it? Okay, <laughs> it took its time there. And then I just throw that down there. Ooh, not too bad. Now what? I mean, there's the present, or the key down there. Okay. Jump on top of this bob -omb. And, uh, okay, uh, that was really silly and not at all what I wanted. So I got the key this time. I'm a little bit nervous with sort of the setup I got going on, but maybe I could just throw this down. Ugh, like that. Get back over here, throw that one over, then I need to get this key fast. Come on, got it. Ooh, so now I have to, just juggle the key. I got like squished down there. Oh no. This one's really difficult. I'm like trying to find an efficient way to do this while also getting everything. And it's really proving to be difficult. So break that open, get back down here, grab that present. Then if I get over here, I can at the least pick up another one and then place it right down this way. I just need to access this next bob bomb so we can just start breaking more stuff up. Okay. Uh. Gotcha. Place it down. No, not like that. Ugh. All right, well, that's gonna really waste my time. Um, Grab you, thank you. Place it down here. Oh, the other one just hops straight off now, so maybe that's for the better. And that's gonna fall down, where I can maybe just hop on top of you and then place you down like this. So I can at least access this like that. And then I need to, yeah, okay, get you to explode. I'm a little bit nervous about our time right now, but I wanna put down there. And this seems a little silly, right? But if I could just clear this area out a bit more, just like we're doing, I can almost get that present. Jump up again, grab this one, throw it over here like this. Uh-oh, no. Uh, okay. I'm glad I didn't get beat up there, but man, I'm not making much progress. We got one minute left. It's really not much time. Bad things can happen here. Put it here? Okay, I know the key's about to disappear, but I'm not as worried about that one. Okay, maybe I could throw. Ooh, not bad, I get this present. Okay, so what I wanna do then is get over to this bob -omb finally, put it down just straight like that. I think we have the time to do this because all I need to do now is wait for this to produce another pop bomb. It's gonna get down there. I'm a little bit worried about this actually, come on. Come on, come on, get over here. I don't wanna get hurt by it. Put it down like that. Okay, now what I do is I grab this one. I don't care about the one-ups very much because it's already been proven to me that that doesn't really matter. Come on, go, go, go. Got it. And then boom, we made it with 12 seconds. What a tricky level. That one was bizarre, but that means we have one more stage left. That was EX7. We just need to move on to EX8. Oh, yeah. Cool. We've gotten the perfect star every time so far. Let's see if we can do it one more time. Right here with the Twilight City waiting for us. What do we got next? Lots of stuff here. I think that uh, we probably wanna go for that present on the left first. Hard to say though. Actually, I don't know if I really even can. Which way are these? These platforms are moving down right now. I definitely want them to move up. So I think we'll switch this straight away. And then have this bring me up. From here, I can pick up the bob -omb and unleash that thing to the left. Don't know if I use it straight away, but having that access is probably pretty good. So. I need to use every moment of the time here because I feel like this is gonna be a tough level just on the idea that, oh no. Oh, okay. Um, it's gonna be tough just because it's such a huge level. Seems like it just keeps going and going. Put it down there. That'll explode that one. Like I said, I don't even know when I'm going to use that. It doesn't seem like now would be a good time. Especially, ooh, when I'm trying to get presents. How do I get over here? Looks like I just bounce up. We can get our second present right there. So bounce, bounce, bounce. 
Grab this one, switch over. What will the yellow one do? It would enable me to get up there, grab that ladder, grab the present. I don't really know how I'm getting to the key. Uh, that's weird. Yeah, how am I getting to the key? I guess if I had the blue switch pressed. Okay, not gonna worry about that for right now. I'll get down here. Why wouldn't I just keep the blue one pressed in general now? Cause couldn't I just run over here, jump up this way, grab that. We have all three presents. I do wanna go down there, but I think we're fine. I just activate the conveyor belt right there, jump across, and unless I'm really missing something, I think we've basically won. Yeah, that's it. Press this, go back down here. Oh, I can't slip down there. Can the key? If I throw the key down there, what do I have to do to get over? I mean, not too much. I would just go to the left. Oh. Uh, hmm. I don't think that goes under. So, turn everything around right now. And then, but now the button's pressed. That's not gonna work. Okay, okay. I got that up there. Trying to really make this work for me. Cause I want the yellow. Yeah, this should be fine actually. Am I overcomplicating this again? Seems like it. No, no, no. Hold on. Jump and throw. Can it not go on one of these platforms on its own? I don't think it can. Duh. Wait, really? Can it not? That's so messy. What do I do here now? Um. Uh, good question. What? Wait, what do I do? I can't toss it on those. I can't just chuck it across. That's gonna hurt me anyways. That's silly. I don't. I don't understand. <laughs> So what I believe I do for this one is I make a big major jump like that. I toss you over there just for good measure. Then with 67 seconds left over, I duck under this one. I want to press this button, pick this up, toss it up there. Go and join it. And then I'll jump over you. I think I want to press this button to reverse everything. No, 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 wait. Hmm. Uh. This is where it gets tricky again. I mean, actually, no it doesn't. I toss that down, I hit this button, I go down with it, and then we're fine, right? I wait for this one, I jump up, I jump across, got it, there we go. All right, so there, that was the last one. That was definitely a challenge, but we make our way through. The EX levels for EX1 are completed. Good job, Mario. That was not easy in the slightest, but we figured it out. Quite the puzzle solver. So there we go, eight golden stars. That's gonna give us a little one-up mushroom. Uh, I'm curious about that, what is this? Whoa, yeah, just wait back over here, we get a little one-up bonus. I might as well, for old time's sake. What do we got? We got a treasure chest. So I will immediately just try to grab that key if I can. Here, hold on. Let's grab this one up while I run over. Oh no, oh, right here, got it. Haha, <laughs> you can't get away from me. Let's go ahead and get a couple more one-ups. We're actually gonna be over you know, a couple of lives here. That's amazing. We're up to 10. Double digits. Never thought I'd see that again. All right. So with that done, EX2 will be our goal in the next episode of Mario versus Donkey Kong. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.